So the other day, I'm uh, I'm wanting to read a book. Like I have several, <laughs> and uh, I haven't had a lot of time lately to read any comics, and I've been kind of jonesing it. And I just, on a whim, just kind of reached over to my bookshelf and just grabbed something. And don't judge me. I grabbed this because it was shiny. Uh, this is <laughs> this is Cable and <laughs> the New Mutants. Um, it's Louise Simonson. Uh, it's it's. Oh my God, it was, I remember I read, like I picked up the New Mutants Monthly and then issue 87 happened and I'm like, what in the hell is this? And looking back at it, and I don't really care what anybody says, this is not good. This is not good. The writing's all right. Some of the writing is all right. It's not her best work, but this art is just so bad. It's just so bad. He's so bad. He's always been so bad. Nothing against this person as a person. This is just a critique of his art. This is my opinion of this gentleman's work. And I can't say I like it at all. Even now, like in retrospect with like the veil of nostalgia. This is not good. At all. Like it's painful. Like my lady was watching me read this thing. She goes, is that any good? And I'm like, no, not really. I mean, it's not bad. The reading part of it's not bad, but the looking at the pretty pictures that aren't really so pretty is kind of just like, kind of hurts a little. This is not good. This is not good. And the first part of this is just like, oh my gosh. The stuff with the blob and pyro, it's just terrible. It's just, look at this. It's just, this is not good. It's just not good. I don't care how you put it, it's just not good. Where? Wait for it. Here you go. This. There you go. Eh, I'm okay. I'm okay. That's good. That's yeah. Anyway, so, this is what I've been reading. Um, I went to the shop yesterday with some money I got for Christmas that my sister gave me, and she's always like, just buy comics. I'm like, okay, so I will buy comics with this Christmas money. I get Christmas money through my family. It's weird. I'm a grown-ass man. But anyway, I'll take that hundred bucks. Thanks, y'all. Uh, so I'm at the shop, my favorite shop, the one where everything is half off, and we're there for almost an hour. And it's kind of starting to like weigh on me because it's like, okay, I'm, I'm looking for issue 41, 38, 39, 40, 42. Okay, so go somewhere else. And it's like issue 19. It's like issue 17, 18, 21. It's like, damn it. So I'm like flipping through my, my CLZ app on my want list, trying to fill in some gaps in some books. And I'm just like, they don't have anything. They got a lot of stuff. This is not stuff I'm going to get. They, their selection of current books is really small and limited. Um, I get it. They don't buy a lot of copies that they don't pre-sell. And that's cool. But like, I don't... I don't know. I don't get a lot of modern books anyway. So it is what it is. So I'm on, okay, cool. That's the end of that story. <laughs> on to the purpose of said video, this one. It's, I was on YouTube the other day and I'm watching 64 page special. He's doing a tag video and he kind of, he does he kind of calls me out and he's like, hey, this would be a good opportunity to do a video. And I was gonna do a video anyway because I had something on my mind. I've since lost that thought, but he, I needed an excuse. I wanted an excuse to pull my books out. I wanted an excuse to, to dig through all my stuff. I moved my couch and I've got crap everywhere and it's, I've, I love it. It's fantastic. You can kind of see the mess. This is like the start right here. This goes back that way a while. and I got stuff stacked that you can't really see. It's like everything here is just stacks of comics. It's fantastic. Um, I'll show you. There you go. Comics, 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 and comics, and comics. I mean, I had all this stuff in a room, but then I lost that room, so now it's over there. But anyway, so the tag video, this is rambling. I've got some coffee, and I might be getting promoted at work. That's cool. So, <laughs> the purpose of this video is my cover of the year, like the as far as books that came out last year. Um, I only get three new books monthly, three, 
and that's Saga. And Fiona Staples covers, though beautiful, aren't really, you know. And I get East to West, and Nick Dragato's covers are even less, right? Nothing against it. It's one of my favorite books. I'm getting, uh, I'm going to order year two of East to West here tonight, later. Um, with my birth, my Christmas money. And, uh, Harold County. And Tyler Crook's covers are great. He has a channel on YouTube. And if you haven't checked it out, I totally recommend it. It's watercolor time-lapse stuff. And it's either pages or a lot of Harold County, the first page, or page two and page three are a splash page. And there's a lot of time-lapse stuff of him doing splash pages in watercolor. It's really neat, or it's like the cover. It's, it's cool. It's worth watching. The music's nice and creepy, and it fits with the, the themes of Harold County. I thoroughly enjoy watching Tyler Crook's videos on YouTube. But then I remembered I had this. Uh, this is Batwoman, number one, from Rebirth, uh, Steve Epton. And I really dig this cover. This is probably, I'll take it out of the bag so we can see it without glare. But I dig it. The, the black and the white and the red and the Steve Epton and the Batwoman. I'm not going to say she never looks so good because J.H. Williams III absolutely positively killed the art on that book. And anyone who hasn't read it should totally check it out. It was rec recommended to me by Cami, our friend, uh, Reader1717. She also recommended this. And I got this last year for Christmas. And I've read this probably 17 times. This is where I'm at right now. This was great right up until the end. And then I'm like, what the hell? But yeah. <clears throat> so my pick for cover of the year, Batwoman number one from Rebirth. Uh, I hope that video made sense. This is the fourth time I've recorded it. I feel a little rambly, but I don't care. I'm excited. I'm, I'm, uh, thanks for stopping by. I'll try to do better. I'm going to order some more books. So I'll be doing a haul video here shortly. Um, but I'm going to be out of free time for a while with my new job. But it's all good because this is what I love to do. So thanks again. I'll see you guys later. Bye.